Okay, everyone, in this video, let's talk about uncropping photos sent by someone else. It really depends. I just want to explain to you this topic because it is technically possible to to uncrop some images. So if I open up the gallery, for example, if you get to this image and if it has been, for example, sent to you by someone using the iCloud link or if, I don't know, you are sharing the iCloud libraries together, perhaps a photo taken by someone else can be reverted back to original state. And if you just want to see if it's possible, all you have to do is just locate a photo, get inside and click on the edit button. So click on edit and there is already a, like a red button saying revert. So when you click on that, you eventually just get to the original state of the photo. But this reverts everything, including the color adjustments and all the things in here, including the filters and everything. So if you want to just uncrop it, just click on the crop tool like this and basically just click on reset at the top. You can see reset button is right there so you can reset it or just like zoom it in with your fingers until you end up with the original picture. So you can technically uncrop pictures on iPhones and even do it if someone else has created that picture. So that's how it works. I wouldn't be worried about that. However, chances are that it's not going to be that simple. In this case, if you already just noticed that this is it, you cannot revert it back to anything. In this case, you are basically just relying on a content aware fill and content aware fill when I'm going to show it to you right now. So it basically is a feature which is also available in Photoshop. Like you can see Photoshop is already looking it up like this. And basically it means that you can use Photoshop on the desktop version, which uses the AI or the latest version of Photoshop uses AI, basically it generates the outside portion of the image. But since you probably know that it is a content aware fill, it's just gonna fill it up with things which look normal on the photo, but it's just not gonna be real, right? So you can use it. You can actually just go ahead and look up some like in-depth tutorials for your computer. Uh, Photoshop app and do it there, but it's just not going to be the best way. It's just going to create some fake surroundings. So it technically uncrops the image or, or enlarges it, but it's not real, is it? It's just going to be like a, you know, stuff which has been added there artificially, quote. So yeah, these are the options that you have. This is how you can uncrop someone else's photo. But yeah, before we wrap up, I need to show you this. You can see on the screen right now, this is the Foxtech educational platform which you can join for free. It's linked down below in the description. And here you can watch many different courses. Like I finished last week, the Dynamic Island full course, everything you need to know about it. Like if you're buying an iPhone 15 or 14 Pro, whatever, definitely go ahead and watch it. You're gonna be like needing this. So yeah, I'm gonna wait for you inside. Thanks a lot for watching and I'll see you guys later in the future.